Well, welcome back. It is official. Marshall University has defeated the Yukon Huskies in the Myrtle Beach Bowl, and now the celebrations are underway. 13 News Sports Director Cassidy Wood joins us tonight from Conway, South Carolina. Cassidy, what a fantastic win for the team. Oh, Amanda, all day today, it has just been incredible. This program has been through so much over the last few years. They went through COVID, then a coaching change, injuries, the transfer portal, the NIL stuff, a conference change. So much has happened to this Marshall football program, and yet these guys have stayed the course, have bought into what Coach Huff has been saying for the past two years, and here they are ending their season on a five-game win streak for the first time since 2000. And two and a, and a Myrtle Bowl victory. I'm going to step out of the way. The guys are actually loading up right now on the buses as we speak. Uh, we just got a chance to speak to both running back Rashina Lee. Yes, he was uh, pretty dominant in this game. He ended up winning the MVP award. So we'll hear from him tonight at 11 o'clock along with senior linebacker Eli Neal. Eli was very emotional after this win, obviously. Um, because of everything they've been through, everything I've listed. I mean, this program has just stayed the course. And as Huff said, it gets back to their foundation, too, and, and what this program has been built on since 1970. They've just been able to stay the course. And, you know, his whole thing is closing the gap. And this is one more uh, thing checked on that list to close that gap. So just a brilliant day, brilliant night here in Conway. That final score, 28 to 14, Marshall. Um, and we'll have that full recap for you guys with highlights and post game from everybody in the trophy celebration tonight at 11. So make sure to tune in then. But for now, live from Myrtle Beach, I'm Cassidy Wood. Back to you, Amanda.